Okay guys, this is Harbor Freight's overhead valve spring compressor that they call universal. Uh, yet I found it actually doesn't work on this Chevy small block head. Uh, if you look at the valve springs, they have like a flat spring steel coil inside of it. And it makes it very difficult for those little arms to get in there. And when they do, these little arms here that, that have to grasp the spring, when they do, they tend to hit these guides. So altogether, not the best tool for this job. Now I realize there's other designs, but um, you know, the couple hours it would take to go out and find one and the good money that it would cost to, to do so, I just found unnecessary. I see that I could pretty much pry them down with minimal effort with this tool that I made. I used a fine threaded nut uh, welded to a bolt that would screw down onto the rocker stud. This is just angle iron here, and this is square tube and a little bit of tape so I don't keep ripping my gloves. And with this down on the top of the cup, I, I have these little feet here that add the right amount of height. With these down on the cup, if you can see in there, they actually it actually pops that right down and over uh, the, the retainer clips there. So very easy. I did that with one arm, the other hand's holding the phone. Um, I've taken the thing apart this far with it. it. It works incredibly well. I made it in about maybe 20 minutes or a half hour and uh, it was free. It was parts I had laying around the garage. So, you know, if you guys are going to be doing this job soon and, you know, your first thought is to go get, you know, the Harbor Freight Universal Compression. I mean, this is a good gadget. It'd probably be great for small engines or, uh, you know, assuming that they have overhead valves or, you know, who knows, maybe it would work in my Toyota, but it definitely doesn't work for the Chevy small block and my free homemade tool does. So, um, yeah, if you like this and you have any questions about it, feel free to ask. It's pretty simple. Just again, threaded, uh, fine threaded nuts. You screw down over the rocker stud, quarter inch bolt welded to it, holding the pieces of angle iron together. And this, uh, those are, you know, of course, welds holding this square tube in the middle, and that's the handle. Thanks for checking me out.